Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about healthcare chatbot. So how you can create a healthcare chatbot for your final year project plus what will you require in order to implement this? What will be the different modules through which a healthcare chatbot is being created? And what is the full process of creating a healthcare chatbot? Plus you can also have can get the source code from GitHub because uh, there are number of repositories that are providing this healthcare chatbot. So I'll be telling you how you can find uh, the URL or how you can find the source for this chatbot. So let us start the video for creating healthcare chatbot. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please click on the subscribe button so that you get important updates whenever a new video is uploaded on the channel. So friends, first of all, if we just talk about chatbot, as you know, that chatbot is they use artificial intelligence, machine learning in order to interact with the customers. And nowadays, every website, every healthcare website, every all the hospitals, they are totally dependent upon these chatbots because these chatbots helps them to engage their patients so that uh, the patients uh, whenever they try to contact there is a chatbot that is always available to answer the queries so basically chatbot will communicate with a real person chatbots are basically used such as e-commerce customer service and call centers and basically the main idea is that they automatically engage the people and they are programmed to respond same way each time and they also learn based upon the answers and then again if a new person comes so they respond based upon their learning so this chatbot is very important and basically the bots connects with the potential patients visiting the website and they help them basically to discover specialists <laughs> they can book their appointment and getting them access to the correct treatment so basically if you if you are going to create a chatbot so it's it's like it's very difficult to create everything from scratch you can have some framework uh, online like you can uh, take help of git repositories so basically what you will be making the key features if you want to make this chatbot different from uh, other chatbots first thing is like you can go for creating a chatbot that is able to predict the disease based upon age so what will you be doing this chatbot will be interacting with the users asking their age their their background uh, and their symptoms their gender the area in which they are living so all this data once collected so it will be collected in the chatbot and then uh, the, it it will be integrated with the API. So this API will uh, will be able to give some prediction based upon the information that is being provided by uh, the user, like based upon his age, like what type of diseases are there uh, based upon the age. So the main thing that is to understand is that you must have a API. Like you have to create an API and that api will be like rule based so based upon the rule like based upon the questions that is being asked so you will just send an api request and that api will fetch all the details based upon age gender region and symptoms so there will be few more questions so this chatbot will be asking and once all the questions are being answered so it will be there will be an api you can create the api or you can have some online third party api that will provide you some types of results based upon the information that is being provided by the user once that information is there you will connect to the api and you will get the results and those results you can show to the user then you can also show available medicine and price so that once the user is aware that okay these are the types of disease that can be there or that based upon is uh, based upon the data that he has provided 
then this uh, then the remedies plus how it can be cured and then you can directly uh, show the prices and also link to the website where from where those medicine can be purchased so basically it will be created in uh, python so you will have app.py python file utilities.py so this as you know the chatbot is being created only in python and the python provides a lot of framework through which uh, you can implement this chatbot so and the main thing is like it's not that you are going to create this chatbot from scratch you just search healthcare chatbot github so you will be having number of chatbots that are being already created you just need to download the, those chatbots and then you can customize because you cannot use directly those chatbots as it is you have to customize like you need you need to create some api or you need to add some new features so you can do that so you can just use this chatbot from the uh, already github store and then you can create and you you have to use python so you need to have installed python on your system then using pip utility you will need to install some modules of that python and then you can use this healthcare chatbot so friends this was an important topic for healthcare chatbot for final year students uh, just try from google try to download try to understand the code and if there is any issue you can comment and we can discuss there on uh, we can discuss there so this is all for how you can create a chatbot if you like this video please like share and like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video